Hi, I'm Rich Harvey, CEO of Property Buyer. I'd like to talk to you today about millionaire migrants and their impact on the property market. There's around 10,000 millionaire migrants that are lured to Australia each year. They're attracted to those top suburbs in Sydney and Melbourne, which are really well healed. And these suburbs are experiencing a mini boom as a result of this influx. So where, why do these migrants come? Well, they're attracted by our stable economy. They're attracted because our political system is quite stable and away from civil strife. They're also attracted to our multicultural way of life and our acceptance of a wide diversity of cultures. Our location is also great for doing business with both China and Japan, and we welcome the wealthy, particularly under our SIV or Significant Investor Scheme, where they need to bring in $5 million and invest that into the local economy. And we also have relatively affordable top-end property, which is in short supply. So what are the nationalities of these migrants? Who's predominantly coming? Well, we're seeing lots of Chinese, we're seeing Malaysian, we're seeing South African, British and Indian coming to our shores. And around 10,000 of these come, which is not a large number in and of itself, but the impact that they have on the property market is quite profound. So where are these migrants choosing to live? Many of the Chinese migrants are moving to the well-heeled suburbs of Melbourne, which includes Turak, Kew, Camberwell, Baldwin and Canterbury where the numbers have increased around 80% in the last few years. In Sydney, they're moving to suburbs like Point Piper, Darling Point, Centennial Park, Double Bay, and on the North Shore, Mossman, Cremorne, and the Lower North Shore. We're also seeing wealthy South Africans moving into some of the beachside suburbs, such as Tamarama, Queenscliff, Bellevue Hill, Vaucluse, and St Ives in Queenscliff. So what is the impact that these migrants are having on these local markets? Well, we're finding that the thing in common is that these migrants are moving to the prestigious suburbs, which is really pushing up demand in just a select few areas. And because they're well-established suburbs in which the properties are really tightly held, it's really pushing prices up. We're finding that the average asking prices can be even 30% higher in some of these areas. And this has an obviously implication for the local market. We're seeing a trickle down effect. So a lot of people are living who are in these areas who are mature couples or long established residents, they're looking to downsize. So they can actually make quite a windfall by selling their property and then moving into a lower maintenance and smaller kind of apartment or townhouse in the area. So there's strong demand in those areas for low maintenance villas and units in those areas. So if you're looking to downsize or perhaps buy in one of these areas, we can access a lot of these properties off market and help make that transition for you so much easier.